So it's got to be him active six months only out of the ring, five, six months, and me inactive 18 months out of the ring. So it's another it's another one up the old uh, Gypsy King's uh, aisle, isn't it? Take that one and put it in your pipe and smoke it. Tonight, the fight world has seen another victim of inactivity in Josh Warrington. Covid has destroyed a lot of careers, can't beat staying active. Yet again, he's laying the groundwork for for post fight, he's doing the pre-excuse. He's planting the seed so, you know, when the fight happens, when he loses, you know exactly what to say, you know exactly what, what to hang your hat on. So yeah, the seed's been planted so, you see in the future, you know what they're gonna, what they're gonna hang the hat on, so don't be surprised. Anyways, but some people are still saying, "Hey, he's he's playing mind games. He's he's, he's he's trying to trying to get Joshua to overlook him." No, no, he's being serious. Like I said, the original statement was not about himself. The original statement he was making was regarding Billy Joe Saunders and other fighters. Unless you're trying to tell me he's somehow playing mind games with Canelo Alvarez or some weird stuff like that's going on then yeah I'll, I'll agree with you but initially he wasn't referring to himself when he was talking about inactivity just like he isn't referring to himself here in this tweet these are his true feelings he's not he's not messing around he's not playing mind games he does genuinely believe inactivity can you know cause him to lose the fight and I don't I don't necessarily disagree with him I think he's telling the truth I agree with him he has been inactive. <laughs> it is. If I was a fan of his, well, I am a fan of his, but for this fan back in AJ, I'll be worried. I'll be concerned. AJ's been active. He has. Um, Fury's been inactive. Yeah, that is a concern for me. But then again, um, but I thought out oh, these two men, someone is a, is the real fighter and has real heart and is a real has real fighting blood and all, all of that crap. What, what happened to all of that? What's activity got to do with anything? This guy's superhuman. Don't don't give me that. Jump in the ring and fight. Show us that 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 you know that stuff you always talk about. All that I'll fight any any man born from his mother's. You know all of that. Show us that. Stop giving us all of these pre excuses. It's not a good look. It's a horrible look. Stop talking about this stuff. If you're not if you don't if you're not prepared to take the fight, don't take the fight. It's simple as. Just don't fight. Don't fight if you think you're inactive. Don't take the fight. If you're prepared, take the fight. Simple as, because I'm not going to hear any of this. It's not going to matter. If you're splattered all over the ring, <laughs> I'm taking a victory, you know? It's a legit victory. Same goes for AJ. If he loses, if he's splattered all over the ring, it is what it is. It's a victory for Fury, regardless of what any AJ fan of, you know, AJ don't give excuses himself, but regardless of what anyone has to say, a victory for fury so i don't want to hear no activity and activity i don't want to hear nothing i don't want to hear nothing because according to most people most boxing fans or most fight fans <laughs> everything's in fury's favor anyways he's got the most skills he's got this that that he switches stance does that that so why is this little little bit of couple of months why why is this you know gonna put everything in aj's favor according to tyson ridiculous how the two men Someone started boxing before the other one, so can we say someone had a head start there? Is, is that is that an advantage for one? And you know, come on, come on, come on, let's just, let's just pull all of this to the side and jump in a ring, Fury. We, we don't care. But you know what it is. I'm that far in front of them all. Doesn't matter. I'm that far ahead. Leagues ahead in boxing ability, heart, grit, determination, punch power, balls. Doesn't matter how much head start I give him, I'll always catch him down the straight. So essentially, you want to pass when you lose, but you want the credit if you win. It doesn't work that way. It doesn't work like that. So if you're that good, just don't bring up this stuff. Why? Why are you bringing it up? <laughs> well, we know why. Excuses, planting the seeds. Anyways, what he was referring to last night was the um. Josh Warrington, Mauricio Lara fight where Warrington got knocked out in there was eight or ninth round. Yeah, he's just, in my opinion, people are still trying to use that whole COVID and um, inactivity excuse. Listen, he got in the ring, he got 
punched and he lost the boxing fight. It's as simple as that for me. None of this matters. If you take the fight, you take the L, you take the W. It's simple as that. Okay, so don't tell me COVID ruined his career. Listen, the guy... Let's not even get into that. Let's not get into all the docking Galahad and all of that. Listen, you got in the ring to fight. You're prepared to take your win and your losses. If you if he won the fight, were we gonna hear any inactivity stuff? He would have used it as, oh look, look, I've been at the ring and look, I'm I'm a great fighter. That's why I was able to win the fight. You're gonna take the plaudits from that. The same way, same way Fury's trying to do it. So, but when he wins, it's gonna be like, oh look, look, I was out of the ring for this long and look, I still managed to win. So you want the credit for it, but you don't want you don't want the the criticism when you lose. Not up in here! This same guy is still still putting out random stuff, random comments like AJ doesn't want to fight me, does AJ have the balls to fight me and all this stupid stuff like when are we gonna move past all that all those childish comments? Oh they don't want it, oh they don't they don't want what? They don't want what? This guy has offered you to fight how many times you're still talking about I don't wanna fight you. I don't I don't understand these people. I don't I don't get it. These people meaning Frank Warren and Tyson Fury in particular, like, ooh, AJ don't want to fight him, they don't want it. Come on, spare me. Or as Frank would say, do me a favor. So, you know, Floyd's about to come back. Well, we don't know if it's still going to happen, but they were, they were saying Floyd might come back. Floyd Mayweather might come back and fight one of the Paul brothers. So, are you trying to tell me we should be worried because this this Paul brother's been active? He's, been, he's probably had, what, two fights? Two fights since Floyd's been, <laughs> Floyd's been away, so he's been active. So, are we worried about Floyd's inactivity? Is, is that what we're doing? C c come on, come on, let's grow up. <laughs> let's grow up. Fury get in the ring, fight, you know, make your best man win. If you win, you get all your credit. Not not due to activity or none of that. You get your credit for beating a man. And if AJ wins, he gets his credit. We don't care about none of that. Clearly, the pandemic never affected AJ at all. He was never inactive at all. AJ's been fighting. AJ's boxed about five times since the pandemic hit right yeah he's just been super active let's keep that in mind he also could be angling for a tune-up fight you know to take a tune-up fight before the aj fight take another um another shot another Seth or safari you know one of them type of guys that might be what all this is all about but i doubt it i think it's just excuses you know pre-excuses but yeah if he wants to tune up I as long as it's a you know a decent fight, I wouldn't mind. You know, I, I would understand if you wanted to take a tune up before the fight. I would understand. I, I obviously want the undisputed fight next, but you know, if he had to take a tune up, I'd understand definitely. Anyways, I'm gonna wrap this one up. Let, let me know what you think of everything I said in this video and Tyson's um, Tyson doubling down, doubling down on his excuses and yeah. Do you are you gonna are you gonna give him a pass <laughs> if he gets knocked out? Is it due to inactivity or is are you are you not having it like me? Drop your comments in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and yeah, smash notification bell. With lots more to come. Lots more to come. I'm out.